Once the city used to pulse with energy, dirty and dangerous, but alive and wonderful. Now, it's something else. The changes came slowly at first. Most didn't realize, or didn't care, and accepted them. They chose a comfortable life. Some didn't. And those who refused to conform were pushed to the sidelines, criminalized. They became our clients. We call ourselves runners. We exist on the edge, between the gloss and the reality. The mirror's edge. We keep out of trouble, out of sight, and the cops don't bother us. Runners see the city in a different way. We see the flow. Rooftops become pathways and conduits, possibilities, and routes of escape. The flow is what keeps us running, keeps us alive. Training time, Faith. Yeah, I know you hate it, but that fall took you out of commission for a while. And now you're back, you gotta keep sharp, especially in this city. Check out these new training grounds, pretty slick, huh? So let's not run around duty, so get to her and just go with the flow, okay? Hi, Faith. Welcome back. Didn't think we'd be seeing you so soon.
Rook wants me to run you through some sparring. You know how he is. You ready? Okay, come on. All right, Faith. Let's run through some weapon disarms, just in case. Remember what I taught you, Faith. Isolate them. Fight them one at a time if you gotta fight. Okay, that's enough training, ladies. Gotta get to the real thing. Drake's got a job for yourself, so check in with him. Faith, let me know when you're ready to get going. See you later, Faith. I'm sure the birds are real impressed, Faith, but once you finish showing off, you think you might concentrate on some actual work? Get Celeste in position for a handoff. You need to get the delivery to her. She'll be near the communication tower ahead of you. Taking your sweet old time, so let's get pissed. She's almost at the comms tower, and you ain't. Get moving and give her the bag. Cell will take it from there. <laughs> Sounds like some blues are headed your way. News chopper tipped them off. You there, Sal? 
What the hell's happening? I can hear gunshots, and that bird seems a little too curious. Faith's on her way. Get your ass ready to move. More blues on the way. Come on, Faith. CP up on you, too. Hey, throw me the bag! <sighs> okay, I got it from here. Okay, they're playing rough cell. I'll be fine. Get out of here! You gotta get off that roof, Faith. Don't care how you do it, just do it. <laughs> this is meant to be a low-key job. Why the hell were they shooting? What did you do, Faith? Nothing. They just opened fire. Don't know what the hell's happening. I'll ask around. Get your ass back to base, Faith. Say again, Officer Connors. Going to see Pope. Robert Pope. Taking a statement on that break-in last week? Anyways, it's uh, 56 West Arlen Drive. Tell Lieutenant Miller. Copy that. I'll relay the message, Officer Connors. Thanks. Connors out. Hello, sis. You there, kiddo? Hey, Mark. I bet you're listening to the chatter. You know me. We'll try and get some sleep. It's been a rough day. I'm gonna put the word out tomorrow. See why those blues got itchy trigger fingers. I'll drop by later, okay? And don't chuck that pizza. I like the topping Much for sure. Matured. Yeah, I know. See you, Mark. Shots fired. Repeat, shots fired. All units proceed to 56 West Arlen Drive immediately. Proceed with caution. Kate! Where are you? Kate, where are you? Hey. Mark. You off? Just get on comms and track me. Almost there. Well, anytime you'd like to tell me where there is and what the hell you're doing, feel free. It's my sister. Ah, uh, okay. I'm gonna see if I can figure out what's going on. Give me a sec. 